How do I download a PDF copy of my passport? Hello everyone. Today, we're going to tackle a seemingly complex task that can actually be made pretty straightforward with the right tools and guidance, creating a PDF copy of your passport. You might need this for a variety of reasons, whether for travel, work or other administrative purposes. In this video, we will show you a step-by-step -step process on how to do it. Why would you need a PDF copy of your passport? Firstly, it's important to understand why you might need a PDF copy of your passport. Sometimes, when you're dealing with online forms and procedures, you may be required to provide a digital copy of your identification documents. Having a PDF copy of your passport handy can make these processes much more efficient and convenient. What do you need to make a PDF copy of your passport? In order to create a PDF copy of your passport, you'll need the following. 1. Your passport. Obviously, you can't make a copy of something you don't have. 2. A smartphone or a scanner, to capture a clear image of your passport. 3. A PDF creator app or software. There are many free apps and software available that can convert your image into a PDF document. How to create a PDF copy of your passport. Now we're on to the main part. Follow these steps to create a PDF copy of your passport. Step 1. Open your passport to the page with your photo and information. Step 2. Use your smartphone or scanner to capture a clear and legible image of your passport page. Step 3. If you're using a smartphone, transfer the image to your computer. If you used a scanner, the image should already be on your computer. Step 4. Open your chosen PDF creator app or software. Import the image of your passport. Step 5. Follow the prompts in the software to convert the image into a PDF document. Step 6. Save the PDF document to your desired location on your computer or device. Now, you have a PDF copy of your passport. And that's it. You've just made a PDF copy of your passport. Remember, this is sensitive information, so be careful where you send or store this document. We hope this guide has been helpful for you. If you have any other tech-related questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. As always, thank you for watching.